So there are these like bridge things, you know, that like railroad tracks used to go over. Okay. And you have to like cross them. Yeah. It does say on everything I've read that the first one is starting to rot out. So it says to be careful. And like, you have to balance yourself carefully. <laughs> what? Wait, so can you get around it or is it like a deep creek? I have no, I don't know if we're talking in like, we need to our it. death or to our lightness. Like, <laughs> It's 9.37, and we're on our way to the Garden Light. Gordon. 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 <laughs> we actually don't know the answer. Gordon. I think it's Gordon. They're Edward. both, they were both born here, I wasn't. Tell us in the comments, is it Gordon or is it Gordon? I would love to know. Right down there. Me too, oh my gosh. It's 10.45. We're all a little loopy, right we'll we'll right If there is more coffee on the way, we'll get some. Yeah, we'll get some. Did your light just get bright? Yeah, it keeps blinking. Oh, it's because it we're going to the Gordon line. <laughs> Garden. Garden. We're almost there. In an hour and you're saying we're I'm <laughs> Near a wooded area of abandoned railroad tracks in Gurdon, Arkansas, lies the mysterious Gurdon light. This light has been described as ranging colors from blue-green, white, or orange. The Gurdon Light has been featured on Unsolved Mysteries and Mysteries at the Museum and has always been a popular Halloween attraction in the area. Legend has it that the light is from a railroad worker who was killed when he fell into the path of a train, leaving the man's head separated from his body. The light that is seen is said to be the lantern of Will McLean, searching for his head. The exact viewing location and where to park cannot be found on maps, and the road to park on is not marked. After many wrong turns, we finally made it to our starting point. We're parked right here. Okay. So this is the road we came down. Now there is an old train track right here. Here's Trussell 1, it's the bridge. We're gonna cross that one. We're gonna hike, we're gonna follow. Trussell 2, we're gonna follow. We're gonna cross <laughs> Trussell 2. We're gonna keep going, we're gonna hike, we're gonna hike, okay. we're gonna hike. <laughs> We're gonna hike. We're gonna hike. We're, we're gonna, gonna hike. hike. We're gonna hike. We're gonna hike. Trestle three. Now it is said that you need to be between trestle four and trestle five in order to see the light. This is, <laughs> this is trestle three. three. So we're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. How there's long trestle is this four. Hike? That's a lick creek. Maybe, yeah. Now I will say there's a road right here called Mac Road. We could have possibly, maybe, no one else has done it or says it talks about it parked on the side of the road there and just like crossed over but i have no idea what that is so yeah we're doing it like everyone online says to do i just i just feel weird that 1. we just 0. pulled miles. off in the middle of nowhere so it's a, it's a little over a mile oh that's not so bad. like how long is that's that so fine okay it's fine are y'all ready we should stop be worrying about material things we're gonna yeah. see a floating light oh god it's so the... chilly <sighs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, is this I'm a, right? I'm a second class boy scout. Oh, we may not see the lights, but we might get killed. <laughs> <laughs> this is scary. We're about to cross Trestle 1. So, here we go. Trestle 1. <laughs> Yo, I'm so scared. Yeah, not good. I'm like shaking. I'm personally. I'm... <laughs> so, that's the second one. There are apparently five, you said? No. So I don't know if you guys can see, um, for those of you who are watching, but like, as you can tell, there's like, it's, that's like a creek. Love that. I love the bridge to Terrapathia. You good? I'm yep. scared. Is that it? I don't like it. That's like something. It's like a shack or something. Is this supposed to be here? I don't know. Are we on the right track? Yes, we are on the right okay, track. I know we are. I'm just scared. I, <laughs> you don't know. What's it called? Now they want to go to Maxwell Blade. Do you hear that? So if you got to turn around. So we realized something very interesting as we've been editing this video for y'all. It turns out as we are walking closer to the Gurdon Light, there is this high pitch that is in the audio of the video. We don't really know why. Our drone was acting up and acting really strange, but as we get closer, you can hear this really high frequency in the video. So we'll show you guys what that sounds like.
Oh my god. Are you are you filming? <sighs> yes. Like yep. Yeah, it is. I don't like that it's right there. Well, what do we do? Do we keep going to go around is, or do we go back? Is this... Well, I mean, we keep going towards it, but like, is this supposed to be here? So there are a lot of different theories about this mysterious Gurdon Gordon light, and it is said that a lot of scientists think that the light appears because it's reflecting off of a highway. But the light has actually been seen way before this highway was built, and we didn't really feel like, I mean, there was a highway near there, but there was no highway reflection or light in sight. There is also a theory that suggests stress on the quartz crystals underneath the Gordon, uh, underneath Gordon causes them to emit electricity and produce the light. They call this the piezoelectric effect. The theory is that the New Madrid fault, which runs through this area, puts intense pressure on the crystals and squeezes them together, which causes them to develop a charge and put off a spark. We don't really know if that's true, but we did think that all of this sounded very interesting. The third trestle? Yeah. Out of? Four. Four. Um, no. I think a tree fell down. Yeah. Oh my I'll god. If y'all do it, I'll do it. So a tree has fallen. Tree has fallen. Should we persevere? We're trying to decide if we want to try to cut through. Oh, hey, bug. Hey. Hey, bug. There's something over here. Huh? What? What did you think? There's something over here. What? Let's just walk. Let's just go back. You realize that when we step, this branch moves? Oh, okay. It's the branch. It seems intentional that, like, the tree has fallen. Should we take it as a sign? I think we should take it as a sign. Should we try to, like, go through the other way just to see? I'm, I'm like... I feel forward. Y'all were waiting for that to be said. <laughs> well, so, like, if the tree wasn't there, I'd still be walking. I don't feel good at all. If we don't feel safe, we don't feel safe. That's okay. And I don't even think it's ghosts feel weird. It's literally just, like, where we are. Those are coyotes. Can coyotes kill us? Uh, yeah. They're more afraid of us than we are. Are you sure? I promise. We have lights. Those are... Y'all, I keep feeling like I hear like a chain. No. Oh, stop. <laughs> no, I know. This is fun, guys. <laughs> Why am I so like scared? Oh, I can't. You done? I'm like, we failed and I'm okay with it. It was terrifying. Look in the camera. Yeah. Truly. Honestly, like that did not feel good. No, it did not. What? Oh, it's a fog. It's spooktober. Spooktober. Literally, we. Oh, did we really did get spooked. What's oh, a pretty plant? No, I don't. <laughs> Bradley leading the way. Strange. I actually feel fine. Is this the car? Oh, thank God. See how strange too, because like, I don't know. How did we feel? Horrible. Not good. Not yeah, a, tr a tree was over the trail. So and that, yeah. That's probably Mother Earth being like, you know, maybe it don't. It was like kind of impossible to get past unless you want to be real adventurous and get lots of bugs. Lots of cuts and scratches. We look too cute to like. Um, you were the bravest in this. You you we won. Were. You won tonight. But like, I, th I can did. I can tell why it was why it was scary though. Why it felt scary. So I found a road that gets really close to apparently where the light is. So we're gonna go and see and explore and see if we. It's after midnight and we're doing this right now. For oh, it's spooky. spooky to do. It is spooky. It's it is spooky. good spooky vibes. It is spooky. It's so How afraid. funny would it be? If we went up here and there was a little path that people and everyone's parked out there going to see this light. Mac. So it looks like private property. And we're not doing that. We're not gonna go. We're not gonna do it. We're gonna be respectful. respectful. The town. Wait, what? So what are we doing? 
It is 1.56. We just, we just got back. made it back. Mm -hmm. It was... Um, it was an experience. It was an attempt. It was an attempt at an experience. It was an attempt. <laughs> no, it was an experience regardless yes. on if we did see the garden lights, regardless mm -hmm. on if we made it to our final destination. I was feeling really bad things, though. Yeah, I didn't feel good about it. I was freaking out. It was I was weird. having... I was not... I did not like it. I could not get back to the car fast enough. I think me and Bradley were like on the brink of having a panic attack. And overall, it's a great thing to do during a pandemic. Yes. Nobody's no there. No one was there. You're literally, literally in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. It, it is true when they say it's like, it's hard to and find. And the bridges are a little scary to pass. So. Chains. That's the thing. I didn't hear any. Did I actually, sh did I shut you down so too? So I was I didn't hearing hear chains and I like said something about hearing chains and then both of y'all were like, no, something. It are just, you getting anxious it talking like, about it? It could have been okay. like a dog with a collar. <laughs> First off, if it? I would have had to run across those little bridges, I wouldn't have. I would, I would have just. I would have made it. Like, yeah. call it ghost, call it whatever, call it the quartz that are underneath the ground, the weird energies, whatever, call it the town. Something fell off about it. Like when we went to that gas station to go to the bathroom, like I asked the cashier and I was like, do you, do you know where the garden light is? He goes, no. Everything was like making me anxious. Yeah. Yeah, it was it was it was strange. That was spooky. That is yeah. you know That should pandemic. satisfy your spooky um yeah. obsession. I I I I won't be doing it again. Honestly, <laughs> thank you for joining. Yeah. <laughs> like no. sorry we didn't see the light. Gordon or Gurdon? So Gurdon. big question of the day is is it Gurdon or Gordon? Yes. And how do you say it? Me. Also, do you know anything about the hoo hoo? If you <laughs> don't laugh at me. <laughs> All right, if you enjoyed this video, pretty please. <laughs> I wanted to say pretty please. It's two in the morning. Please like and subscribe and click the bell notification. Right down there. Right there. here. Right there. Um, for more videos from mm -hmm. us. Gordon Gurdon. Uh, I want to go back. I probably will. Okay, we'll listen. Yeah. If this gets 50,000 likes <laughs> by tomorrow, we'll, we'll then go. we'll go back. Yeah, we'll go. Come, Come travel, travel with us. us.